What's going on everyone? Thank you for tuning in to another episode of Kev Scooter Motor Vlogs. Currently in Ceres, California. And I did feed the cats today, as you guys can see. It's been two days I've not fed these cats and today they were hella hungry. You guys have a good day now. Be all nice and full. I'll see you guys tomorrow with another feeding. Man, it sucks, you know guys? But I guess, yeah, what I mean by it sucks is, um, I don't know why it happened to be me, the one I got. I don't know. I keep on asking myself, why do I take it upon myself to feed these cats? Because if I don't, I don't think nobody else is going to, guys. There's like six cats that were little kittens here. I've been feeding them for three months. They've grown up since the time they were little kittens now. But uh, I've not fed them for two days and they were starving. So today I was happy to uh, I fed them and I'm back on track. I bought another big bag of dog food last night. Or cat food, excuse me. Yeah, I, bought a, I got a dog at home so I get sometimes confused. But yeah, I went to Walmart last night and bought a 44 pound bag of uh, cat food. It came up to 25 bucks. It lasts all month. It's just that last month I ran short. I was like two days out without feeding them. Yesterday and the day before. And then yesterday I got a little money in and then went straight to Walmart knowing I was going to see them this morning. I could have easily just done it this morning on my way back. Skipped their feeding again today but I got my lazy butt up last night. I said, you know, I'm going to see those cats in the morning. They're going to be hungry. I better get my butt to Walmart now so I can have the cat food for them in the morning. So that's what I did do. Now I can get on with the rest of my day. When I'm at home, I don't have to worry about, man, I didn't feed the cats today. I bet they're hungry. They depend on me and whatnot. Because once you start feeding them, guys, if you find stray animals anywhere, they're going to recognize, like if you go, like, basically, let me run this back. I go to this here uh, clinic appointment every uh, day right now. And what I notice is, they recognize my scooter, they recognize me, because I, I watch when other people roll in, the cats, they don't uh, react to them like they do with me. They understand I'm the person, the sound of my moped, and everything that, hey, food's coming. Because as I'm riding up, down that back alley right there all the cats start running towards the back corner and it's like man if I don't feed them who's gonna feed them and they really they literally uh, look forward to me coming every morning damn man awful sight in the road yellow cat it was all smeared everywhere but yeah you know guys I'll back it up I know I mentioned this in a couple videos but I want to say this one more time I started going to this clinic and um, came out one day, one morning, and uh, lit my cigarette, took a couple drags, and I threw it on the ground. And a cat came out of the bushes, picked up the cigarette, and uh, sort of like shook his head, like burnt his lip or something, you know. And I was like, poor thing was starving, man. They didn't know it was a cigarette. What the hell? Felt so bad for the cat, man. I felt bad because I threw down the cigarette that was lit and it burned them. That, but then I started thinking, man, this cat's so hungry that he didn't. He just automatically treated it like it was food. And then uh, I just thought about it right away. How much money I got in my wallet? And I went straight to the nearest grocery store, bought a five-pound bag of cat food, came back, dumped it right there for them, and then uh, I started buying five pound of uh, cat food every day and that's like five dollars every day then I finally did uh, like a month and a half of doing that and I was like man this, if I buy in bulk I bet it'd be cheaper I could feed them more have more food for them and I could actually afford it better so twenty five dollars a month compared to five dollars a day that's a lot better guys so finally got wise and decided hey I'm gonna continue feeding these cats how am I gonna do it five dollars a day or $25 a day or a month so yeah I go to Walmart pick up a big old 44 pound bag every morning I come I bring a little grocery bag I'm always having grocery bags around the house so throw in a good old couple quarts of food of cat food in there 
pour it out for them and it makes me feel good they eat for the day and at the same time I don't feel like a dirt bag I don't feel like I don't know why it's just I won't feel right if I don't feed them I get to I go home every time I eat something I think about those poor cats they didn't eat today because why I didn't feed them but now it's like oh, I think sometimes God why 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 is it got to be me that's feeding these cats because one answer comes up is because I know you would do it and uh, you know I'm a Christian guys I started thinking well if that's what is in my heart that God put in my heart to feed these cats and I take it upon my I take it pretty serious guys you know if I don't even got to come up to this clinic I make a special trip and I'll come over and put their food for them and I'll take off and get on with my day but yeah if it's up to me then it's up to me I ain't gonna gripe about it there's a homeless camp right there I see some bright colors I was thinking what was that it looks like a tent or some kind of makeshift camp or something you guys ready for a canal bank ride let's go on this little canal bank ride right here shall we I like this here business this person started I can imagine the money they make which is good they started off with one limousine guys and look at how much they expanded they got any kind of luxury look luxurious or luxurious vehicle for your needs I don't know their number or what's their name of their company or not man but they're located right here in a mix of series and keys and um, good for them that's how they support them and their family off of that limousine uh, company. So much props, man. You know what I noticed after rain and stuff? You got to watch out on these canal banks because the rain really opens up a lot of holes in this dirt. It'd be all smooth ground. And then before you know it, a big old freaking crack like an earthquake happened. I'll show you right up. It'd be like maybe five minutes up. So enjoy the scenery for right now guys. I'll shut up. Just, just enjoy the ride and the scenery. Soon these canals are going to be filled with water guys. It's the end of February today. February 28th, the last day of February. Two thousand twenty one. Put down my visor to kill that wind noise from coming in. I really am wondering what the hell these things are. Drop a uh, your drop it in the comments guys, what you guys think they are. I think they're like little huts. They sit out here and hunt for birds. They got a hut over there. They got this one right here. Then they got one way over there. And just, I'm thinking they're just sitting there with their shotguns, put out their fake buoys like ducks or birds out here. And then there must be some kind of bird hunting people. Really don't know what else to make of that, guys. All right, that's a church up there, guys. So this is the back of the church property. I don't know what the hell this is. I would expect church people to be hunting out here like this, but who knows? All right, there's three one three sheds over there. I got this one here and that one there. And the first thing that comes to my mind is uh, like what do they call it? Sweat lodge tents for? But that's not that's Indian religion. So I'm thinking these little things, they're not like uh, greenhouses. There must be like to sit in there and put out your little fake ducks 
and wait for birds or something to come and land and shoot them. But I don't think they'd be shooting shotguns when there's residents around, you know? I think they do that way out in the cuts, not in town like this. Really don't know what else to make of that. Anybody else uh, might know, just drop it in the comments. I'm sort of wondering. I've been wondering. Every time I come through here, I always wonder what the hell that is. Man, my camera angle was all low. Sorry about that, guys. Must have been whenever I shut my visor down. I really hope it picked up that video in that field, but I doubt it. Some loose dirt coming up. Uh, slow 